Welcome back to DL.TV. I'm Patrick Norton. And I'm Robert Herring. Got some good stuff for you. Magnus says, how can I increase my Wi-Fi signal? My desktop is on one side of the room and on a completely different floor from the router. Now, you could go out and spend like $50 for an antenna to bolt onto the back of your router. Or 20 bucks, 50 bucks. It's like what a 7 dB antenna is usually going to cost you. It's going to be about this high. And you have to make sure you actually even have the removable antennas on your router. And if they're not removable, unless you really enjoy cutting things open and hacking and violating warranties, you're not going to put up the super antenna on your router. Which brings us to the fabulous windsurfer. <laughs> Oh, that is the name. That is the name. You this mock, is, this you is laugh. Cool. This is cool, inexpensive technology. This is a parabola. <laughs> Parabolas are very simple. They like to reflect things. In this case, the RF energy that's coming out of the antenna. Why do you care about that? Trust me, folks. If you can find aluminum foil, do we have aluminum foil? I mocked this. You mocked this. At first sight, I was going, what are you doing? <laughs> aluminum foil. Don't even bother asking mom. She won't care as long as you don't take the entire row. Glue or a glue stick. Remember glue sticks? Did you oh, use yeah. these? These well, are amazing. I, I would just like one tube of uh, super glue to last longer than, I don't know, a month. Well, super glue doesn't it last seems, longer than yeah, a month. Yeah, it seems like as soon as you use it, just... Apparently, I have to go back to using the... Elmer's all-purpose glue since I'm not licensed to operate the new fancy glue. Hey, I mean, yeah, if, glue. if you can spread glue on aluminum foil and then press one of these on it, you are good to go. And this is the pattern, actually. This pattern... Is that the template you can print out? Yeah, basically you glue this, the aluminum foil, you cut the template out, and then you fold. You know, it's, it's real basic slot A into tab B kind of stuff, or as most people in the world would say, tab A into slot B kind of stuff. And once you assemble it, it actually works to do, if you do on this size, the larger size, about uh, 10 to 12 dB of boost. For the smaller size, about 9 decibels of boost. You were showing the, the, the template for the small one there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the basic template. If you Basically, if you double the size of the template, it's going to increase the amount of boost you're getting to, from 9 dB to about 12 dB. So this par parabolic reflector you've mm -hmm. made, in a sense, it takes that what normally be radiating from all directions from the antenna. Exactly. Little broadcast towers, and it then directs it makes it a directional antenna? You're basically, yeah, I mean, for, once you've done this. For the cost of a printed page, and a little a bit of aluminum foil. Glue. If you have time, you can do this. This actually was amazing. This doubled, almost doubled the signal from one side of my old house to the other one. The house, it was like made out of lead That's sheets. Awesome. And uh, we've <laughs> awesome actually got a before and after. And easy. Yeah, it's really cheap and easy. This is actually the before. You probably can't read that once it's compressed. 82% on the signal strength on that. And once we popped the fabulous windsurfer on there, Watch it, ooh, up to 100%, actually stronger than the commercial grade router that's sitting 30 feet closer to my system inside of our, our floor here. It looks like an IBM Access Connection software that I, I don't know, refuse to touch. It's pretty. It's it looks shiny. pretty. I like the distance thing. That looks like, oh, this one's in range. <laughs> this one's closer to 100%, so it's better. Even I can understand <laughs> it. Um, freeantennas.com is the source for that. It's a great, great website. They basically list, you know, they got some of the stuff like the classic Pringles game antennas listed up there, but what you're looking for is the Easy 12 Parabolic Reflector Template. <laughs> you know, it's, it's such a large name for such a simple in thing. In a sense, too, can you also, since it's reflecting in that direction, you, you don't, in a sense, be cutting the signal in the opposite direction. Yes. So if you wanted to, like, that's my neighbor always it. jumping on my Wi-Fi, I yeah. could then direct these toward my rooms and away from my neighbor and exactly. I mean, that's be, what I be cruel and unusual. Is I basically put it in one corner of the house and aim the parabolas towards the opposite corner of the house, and it just Good deal. basically really up the signal. I mean, I've actually also nice. seen people do really simple things like, you know, open up a Pringles can and just create... If you really want to get like low rent temporary in the hotel room <laughs> and you happen to have some aluminum foil with you when you travel, I ah. don't know why and I don't want to know why. Call room service. Yeah, call room service. They always have the aluminum foil. But basically, look, these are really easy to make. You can put them together in like 10 minutes and 9 to 12 dB a boost is uh, for like 25 cents is a lot better than paying 50 bucks for a 7 dB on the antenna. Yeah, that's a simple solution dude, that anybody could do. Yes. Anyway, uh, a lot of people have printers. A lot of people have foil. And a lot of people have poor Wi-Fi reception, so <laughs> it's got to be something there for it. Yeah, just be careful with the scissors or the X-Acto knife or whatever you use, because the cutting a little hurts your ears. <laughs> Those problems take care of themselves, <laughs> one way or another. <laughs> I'm not even touching that one. <sighs> Test Drive Unlimited, Garnet Lee from up at oneup.com has the scoop on his newest favorite. It's kind of a stealth game. He's going to tell us why. 
Yes, and we have the final word on HDMI outputs on the Xbox 360 HD DVD straight from the Microsoft PR rep. We'll be right back.